Hello, my name is Dalia Ibelhoptaite. I am co-producer on Apple TV Plus original film Ghosted. Um, this is the first film where Dexter and me working together uh, as a team uh, officially from A to Z. Because up to then, all the work we did, uh, since I had my other career and day job being opera director and producer, I couldn't participate so much in his film work. But after The Rocket Man, we made decision that we will stick together. I'll give up my day job and I come and be part of his team. So we started uh, to talk about Ghosted about one year ago, very early on, when he started conversations with Sky Downs and Chris Evans about the project. And um, it was very exciting because it gave possibilities for Dexter to do big action film and to challenge himself. And um, I was very excited and very glad to be part of that journey. Dexter has the attitude that you cannot make the first impression second time. You have to make first impression first time. And he knows very well that the world will be watching for his action sequences, that they have to be the most exciting, they have to be most challenging, most unusual, and he's done you know, about four times better than my expectation. But that's the great thing. When you work with somebody, you spend 27 years of living together. You don't lie. Chris comes across as very smart actor, actor who very deeply researches everything, very deeply thinks the whole thing through, who maps out his journey and his journey in the context. So um, it's a person who turns up every day, um, but what you see on the day is 10% iceberg, but the work he's done is at the 90% of the iceberg, which goes like deep, 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 which he started ages ago. He's not the person who just shows up, whatever. It's very talented team of people. I would say that uh, the beauty of the project is how different is Anna de Amos and Chris Evans in that the way that uh, she is a very intuitive person. She is very, um, like, she changes much more um, reflects what's outside, what is inside the relationship. So it's beautiful how they play off each other. I think it's a, one of the most exciting new um, movie uh, couple partnerships, uh, which the world will see, and I hope it will carry on for a very long time, uh, pass beyond this film, because opposites attract. That's what's amazing, that they are very uh, different and very interesting to watch. And then, of course, it was very exciting casting to be part of that, because each actor on this project is like diamond. They are wonderful, very talented people, very talented actors, very, uh, again, Maybe not always you meet in the pure action films um, that kind of actor. So it's great, like Adrian Brody, uh, Tim Blake Nelson, T. Donovan. It was wonderful. So create the world, create actors, and be part of all this journey. It was wonderful. First of all, we're thinking about humanity and about the heart, about the soul and energy of those people. Because it's very important to select people who have different energies. That's when they play the best, you know. Uh, when you get contrast, when you get light and darkness, when you get fast and slow, when you get different skills. Uh, come together. And the same is with creative team. Uh, Dexter chosen amazing teams of designers uh, like Claude Paré is wonderful artist, Marlene Stewart Costumes, wonderful artist, Claude is um, set designer. And, um, you know, um, that 
I got very close to those people because part of, again, my training is in art. From very early age, I studied composition um, in, of paintings, on photographs, studied paintings, so on, so on. So that is part of what I do as, as well. I advise Dexter and help him to make those choices of compositions, of art, of sets, costumes, and so on. And then, of course, it was great to meet a Jules Daily producer. It's wonderful to work with women producer. It's wonderful to you know, see uh, different approaches to the producing and to the projects. Me being woman as well, it was very great, you know, to see how people do, do it. And um, yeah, so that was the very beginning. I believe in one very important thing, that on a big project like that, everybody has to play their best part, what they know the best. So you need to know what is your skills and what you uh, offer in, in that field. And it was wonderful to work with the designers. It's so, you know, for Dexter it's very important not to dress people, but to create the characters so that their costumes tell their life story and tell who they are. And uh, in Marlene Stewart, he found great partner in that. And uh, with Claude, um, again, what's very important for Dexter, to find authentic looks of a restaurant, of a market, of caves, of the world, uh, of the bus, you know. Uh, we think, ah, bus is bus. But bus in Afghanistan and Pakistan is very different bus from what we know. And um, it went massive research for this film into everything, into sets, costumes, props, characters, huge research. So every single thing people will see, audience will see, it's... Yes, it's flight of fantasy, but it's not taken from the thin air. Everything is taken from research and reality, real world. So it has the heart and energy of real world. My uh, biggest sequence, I will be the most proud, well, I hope to be most proud, is um, we call it Middle Eastern Market. This was the sequence which had 350 extras of uh, Middle Eastern origin, which is quite hard to find, uh, to be very authentic. We researched and planned that scene for four months uh, because each person has different character. Uh, each person has different costume. Most of those costumes are authentic. Um, and even the ones which are made, they are made on the basis of authentic. And every single makeup and hair is chosen from authentic photos of um, Middle East um, life uh, from the books and so on. So that was the hardest sequence to do. I learned one thing about action films and big action. It's like choreography like choreography of dance. Uh, I know it because uh, it's opera, so dance, ballet, and here is choreography of the moves, uh, the action. So it's the same. And it was wonderful to create visual choreography of uh, the market, of the movement of people, of that, uh, and show the faces. And I think that is going to be really exciting world, we will be introducing all the Western world audience to something they may not be went and experienced themselves. So I think that this movie will have a very wide audience. And maybe my hope is that this movie will be seen by people who not normally go to see action movies. And um, that is great because I'll be new <laughs> group of people. And also I hope that people who always see action movies, they will be able to see some details which uh, will give them different.